We're here on Butte Creek in Northern California with an urgent salmon extinction update. Last week, brown and orange sediment completely overwhelmed Butte Creek when the PG&E maintained Butte Creek Canal breached. These are the three things you need to know about this environmental disaster right now. Number one, Butte Creek is the last remaining stronghold for spring run Chinook salmon in the entire state. And until very recently, Butte Creek boasted one of the largest spring run populations on the entire west coast. Number two, there were salmon here in Butte Creek when the canal failed. Spring run Chinook are different from all other species of California salmon in that their journey from the ocean to freshwater begins in the springtime. They travel over 100 miles to Butte Creek where they find a deep, cool pool to hold over for up to five months before they spawn in the fall. Salmon and other native fish like trout and pike minnow can survive brief episodes of sedimentation, but we're being told this event lasted for days and days. And in fact, Butte Creek is still brown right now, four days later. Little to no survival is expected for all species. And really, I've been here in the summer. The salmon formed this kind of core of life and you can see the salmon swirling and because of all the animals come in and this place here is is a magical spot in california and it's uh it's eerily empty right now number three this event right here might be the final blow for spring run chinook in california spring run lived three to four years in the ocean before returning to spawn and with this disaster we will now see four years in a row with below average or maybe zero survival. This means the population here in Butte Creek will most likely never recover, and at its worst, it's on the verge of collapse. Spring run Chinook salmon in California are going extinct right now.